Gab, who is Fabio Paim and what has he done to upset Cristiano Ronaldo? <laughs> yeah. Okay, well, first of all, he's more famous now than he used to be, but he was on a podcast in, in Portugal. So he's a guy who, as a young man, he played for Sporting. Um, I think he's two years oh, younger well, than, a bit than, of a prodigy, yeah. than Cristiano. He's supposedly a prodigy, prodigy. Ended up going to Chelsea very young. Never quite worked out. But he's in this podcast, and he said, look, I was a really talented player. Um, he said, I knew Cristiano really well because we were there together. Although, again, age-wise, Cristiano's several years. So I think he looked yeah, up yeah. to Cristiano. But, and he, but he said, I could have been like Cristiano if I had half his brain, which I take as a compliment to Cristiano, saying that like this guy was maybe an idiot, he screwed around yeah, or whatever, yeah, definitely. whereas Cristiano's dedicated and intelligent to a sport, whatever, right? Yeah. And then he joked Until that, then, that was fine. It's the joke after that. that The joke where he said, like, you know, he said, I should, I deserve one of his Ballon d'Ors. Like, maybe he means that like, he would have won one of the many. Cristiano does not see the humor in it. Uh -huh. He said, like, it would not have been Messi and Cristiano, it would have been Messi and me, as in, like, dominating the football world for 15 yeah. years. He's and obviously like, joking, right? Come on. No, seriously, I, I, either no, the I man know, is disturbed or he's joking. But Cristiano doesn't see the humor. He writes, WTF, who is this guy? <laughs> Which, you know, I, Cristiano, chill. Okay? This guy's not even? casting shade on you. Oh, exactly. He's complimenting Don't you. Don't bother about that. Yeah. No Don't need to bother. punch down. No. Nah.